So hello students. I'd like to welcome you back to class and we're on page 35 and we're on grammar focus. But before we get into the lesson, let's do a verb tense review because grammar focus is on simple present tense. And so let's review simple present tense, okay? And so you're going to look at the slide and on the slide you're going to see three columns present, past, and future. Present is today and every day. Past is yesterday. Future is tomorrow. And so present, it's true, is today. Present is right now. Present continuous is some action that is happening right now. Okay, uh, I watch the video every day. But present continuous, I'm watching the video now. We don't say, I'm watching the video every day. We say, I watch the video every day. But past is not just yesterday. Past is one minute before now. I just, I turned the camera on. Okay, that's past tense. One minute ago, I turned the camera on. That's past. 30 seconds ago is past. And the same for future. Future is not just tomorrow. Future is 30 seconds from now. Future is one second from now. One second from now is in the future. And so don't just think that past is yesterday. Past is this morning. Past is what happened a few minutes ago. And future is what will happen in the next minute, five minutes two hours, or tomorrow, or far into the future. And so we're going to practice, we're going to practice the uh, present, past, and future. These are some very simple sentences, but you'll need to focus on pronunciation, and you'll need to focus on saying the final consonant. All right, so let's do it. I walk to school. I walked to school. I will walk to school. Walk, walked, walked, walked would be like W-O-K-E-D. Think in your mind. W-O-K, walk, and then you add E-D, walked. But the D sounds like a T. So think in your mind, W-O-K-E-T, walked. Walked. I walked to school. You need to say that. I walked to school. I walked to school. I will walk to school. Tom bikes to school. Bikes is an action word, the action of riding the bicycle. We can say, I, he bike, I bike every day. Tom bikes to school every day. Tom biked to school this morning. Biked. You notice the T also has, the D also has the T sound, biked. He will bike to school tomorrow. Okay, walked, biked. Both of those ED words have the T sound at the end. I dream of being free. I dreamed of being free. Dreamed, D-R-E-A-M-E-D, -E -E but the D sounds like the D this time. I dreamed of being free. I will dream of it again. This is why it's important to listen to a native English speaker because some of these like walked, biked, dreamed, if you listen to a native English speaker, you'll catch it. I study hard. I studied hard. I will study hard again. I buy milk every morning. I bought milk this morning. Notice, most past tense words, we just add ED. But sometimes, the form 
of the past tense changes. The word actually changes, buy and bought. I buy milk every morning. I bought milk this morning, but the tea is not strong, but your tongue should touch the top of your mouth to make the tea sound, even though it's not strong, but it's t -t very quiet, but it's not bought. You have to put the tea there. I will buy milk tomorrow. I, I read my book every day. I read my book this morning. I will read my book tonight. Jim texts his friends. In Khmer, we say Pyasa. Jim messages his friends. It's easier to say. But texts, the KS sound, T E X K X X E X X. Jim texts. Just say it like this. Jim texts his friends every day. But you need to hear the S. Text. Jim texted his friends. Past tense. Jim texted his friends. Jim will text them tonight. Pam kisses her mom. Pam kissed her mom. K-I-S-S-E-D, but the D sounds like T. Pam kissed her mom. Pam will kiss her mom goodnight. It is sunny. It was sunny. It will be sunny. Time flies. What does it mean, time flies? It means things happen very quickly. It seems like only yesterday that I was five years old. It seems like only yesterday I met you. Time is, seems like it goes by very quickly. That's what it means, time flies. The time just flew. It went by very fast. Time will fly again if we're not careful. I say hello when I meet people. I said hello when I met you. I will say hello when I meet another person. Okay, say, said, will say. All right, you say them after me, all right? You practice saying these after me. I walked to school. I walked to school this morning. I will walk to school tomorrow morning. Tom bikes to school every day. Tom biked to school this morning. He will bike to school this afternoon. I dream of being free. Last night I dreamed of being free. I will dream of being free forever. I study hard every day. I studied hard last night. I will study hard again. I buy milk every morning. I bought milk this morning. I will buy milk tomorrow morning. I read my book every day. I read my book this morning. I will read my book tonight. Jim texts his friends every day. Jim texted his friends this morning. Jim will text his friends this evening. Pam kisses her mother good morning. Pam kissed her mother good morning. Pam will kiss her mother good night. 
It is sunny today. It was sunny yesterday. I think it will be sunny tomorrow. Time flies when you're having fun. The time just flew by. The time will fly again if we're not careful. I say hello when I meet people. I said hello when I met you. I will say hello when I meet another person. So, this is a very good lesson for you and I recommend that you watch the video again. You need to practice the pronunciation for past tense. Walked, biked, dreamed, studied, bought, read, and you need to pay attention to present tense. Past tense is one second before now. Future tense is one second after. So I recommend that you watch this video again and you practice the pronunciation. And when we read the sentences together, you, you practice the enunciation, I'm sorry, the intonation as well. All right, so this is an introduction to the grammar and we're going to do another short lesson after this one.